Welcome back to the Ultimate Doom. This is the secret level for the third episode, and if it looks familiar, that's because it is exactly the same as the uh, the first mission in the episode, Hellkeep. Uh, this one is called the Warrant. It has some extra stuff, which we will get to in a second. But uh, we've got the Kaka Demons here, uh, just like the first mission. Now this time, I've got some bigger weaponry, so it's going to be a lot easier getting through them. Oh, that guy did a lot of damage there. Uh, I'm not too worried about it. There are a couple of soul spears that I can pick up along the way, so hopefully I'll finish this level with close to 200% uh, health. These guys may start attacking themselves as well, and maybe not. I'm not going to wait around to see what happens. Uh, so here we go, through this little corridor again. This time we're going to use the chain gun. And uh, here we are at the end of the, uh, the level. Uh, at the end of what was <laughs> the end, of, oh, there's a few of them still alive in there. Uh, what was the end of the uh, the first mission? There's quite a few of them still alive in here, and the secret is in the same spot. There's just one secret for this level, and uh, that was it. Uh, so it looks like the end of the level, but things are going to change once I head onto that teleporter pad, uh, which isn't actually a teleporter pad, uh, and uh, we've got a cyber demon. So things are certainly a lot different uh, than they than they were. First time around! Uh, if you do start to get into some trouble, there is uh, an invincibility. Which I may go and pick up in a second. Uh, let's go... Um Finish him off before uh, the invincibility disappears. Trying to dodge these uh, these missiles. There we go. Whew. So we've taken out another cyber demon, and uh, this time he wasn't even a, a big boss at the end of the level. There's still a little bit more to go. Uh, so we've got the soul sphere there, and uh, up here we've got the uh, was that the rocket or the plasma gun, and then we've got uh, invisibility here as well. Um, through here, so we're going to make our way back through the level. Uh, this time there's a couple of cacodemons just in here. If I can target them. Oh, did I get them both? Uh, I think I did, did uh, take them both out there. Got some more shotgun shells and uh, nothing in that secret area. Uh, now this area is opened up as well, and we've now got a Baron of Hell here. Um, there is... Uh, it's not a secret, but there is a little something over here. Let's just quickly make a run for the uh, radiation suit. Just want to get away from those souls, because they can actually uh, do quite a bit of damage. Okay. Uh, so there's quite a few spectres in this room. And as you can see, this has, has all opened up. This used to be the, the small corridor where we fought the, uh, the demons, but now it's opened up and there's a bunch of spectres here as well. So when you press this button, this lowers and uh, more spectres are released from this little alcove over here. I 
I'm not going to pick up... Oh, there's one more. I'm not going to pick up those items yet because uh, I do want to save the, uh, the invincibility for a little bit later. So instead I'm just going to run down here. Take out these Cacodemons, first of all. Whoops. I was not expecting them to have moved uh, so far across. I was going to run out, but it's like I'm stuck in, stuck in here for now. Whoa! <laughs> I was not expecting him to be there as either. I don't, I'm pretty sure... Oh, maybe they can fit in. I, I didn't think they could fit in these corridors, but I guess I was wrong about that. And I've made life a little bit difficult for myself by trying to take them out from inside here. Should have just run out when I had the chance. Alright, there's one more. Okay, so let's just pick up the plasma gun here. Now, I did uh, save the, in the invincibility, and that's for this area over uh, here. First of all, I just want to go and grab uh, some items. I'm going to take a little bit of damage here, but let's go and take the BFG, uh, the radiation suit there as well. Where am I going? Going the wrong way here. Okay, so now I'm going to take up the uh, invincibility and uh, quickly run back this way. And uh, once you go through this corridor over here, you get teleported to the corner. There's little uh, cacodemons, and there's a whole bunch of enemies here. A whole bunch of enemies here. So just try and take them out with the, uh, the BFG as quickly as possible. And uh, hopefully you'll be able to do it before the invincibility um, disappears. Um, but just down this corridor here, there's a red skull key. When you pick that up, Baron is released. And uh, behind him, we have the plasma cell uh, pack. And uh, when you take him out, uh, three Barons of Hell are released here. Okay, so we managed to take them out without too much trouble. Another soul sphere there, which is why I wasn't worried about taking too much damage a little bit earlier on. So back up to 200% health. Heading back out, got the red key now. Uh, things are a little bit different here as well. So instead of another switch, we've got uh, the red door. And this leads to the teleporter, which is the exit from this level. So the warrants have been finished. 100% kills. 100% items and 100% secrets and time just over 8 minutes. So that's the end of this, this mission, the secret mission for the third episode. And next we'll be heading into the gate to Limbo.